Hello and welcome back. Today we're going to try a new tool here called Hacktronian. Sounds like a really bad movie. So without further ado, let's go and jump right into the tool. So I try tools sometimes so you can get a feel of how is this tool. And <clears throat> basically I just installed it and if you want to see how I installed this tool, just look in the description below and you can find a link that explains you how to install this tool. I want to say it's pretty easy to install, so no worries about that. Now, I'm running on Linux Kali already. I got this tool booted up, and please do run this at root, else it will not work. Now, I booted up a room here on TryHackMe, which is my typical testing area when I, it, whenever I do some reconnaissance or something like that. I'm going to try and use that as my reference to a online server. We can see this is a all-in-one tool. We've got information gathering as the first, password attacks, wireless attacks, exploitation tools, sniffing, spoofing, web hacking, private web hacking, post exploitation, install the Hacktronian. And <clears throat> if I press zero, we are, yeah, press yes. So <clears throat> now since I already have this installed, it's uh, probably just an update this pressing zero, so <clears throat> let's try to look at the very first one called information gathering. So let's click the one and it's gonna show different things like nmap, port scanning, set toolkit, host to IP, WordPress user. Okay, so let's try something we know. Nmap, the first one, continue, yes. Cloning into nmap. So, it seems like the tool we didn't choose is gonna download it and have it ready for us in a way. I th <clears throat> think this on demand kind of piece of software is fine, but why not utilize the nmap already installed in this computer? So while this is installing, I'm gonna pause the video and get right back in a second. So we are back. Now it tells us that nmap is successfully fully installed. Okay, let's do it one more time. Information gathering, nmap, continue. All right, so this is basically the same thing again. I'm gonna, yeah, I can do that. So it seems like this tool is basically just for getting things installed. Now, I didn't know that, you know, I just, eh, I just figured I'm, I'm gonna try this tool. Of course, it's, it seems like a everything in, in, in one tool. What about wireless attacks? It says Reaver, Pixie VPS, yeah, Bluetooth, Fluxion, so we can install the tools from this tool. So this is a great install tool. Now, I didn't know this before, so let's see. Gravity, file upload, yeah, I think, you know, if you're gonna go all in, go ahead and, and, and run the Arachne or or maybe even the uh, Nessus, but I don't think Nessus is here for us to choose. Let's see, post exploitation, what is that? Shell checker, poet, phishing framework, hmm, interesting. Number two cup and in crack it's very funny that they recommend these two tools i haven't really used them before i usually just use you know uh john the river so let's go ahead and just go and check what is password hacking cup all right so it's uh it's a Powerful password lists uh, covers, which is a wordless generator. It can be used to generate custom. Yeah, so it is really fine, but generating word lists is not really what I was looking into. So, yeah, well, that, I guess that that's a minus for this tool. A, a plus is that you can basically, without doing anything, you can say like, so I want to do something with sniffing and spoofing press number five and you get stuff like this. Now, someone made this tool and necessarily I wouldn't be 100% agreeable with the choices. Information gathering, it's like, yeah, but yeah, not really sure. 
What is the the argument for choosing crisp? What is the argument for choosing XSS strike and so on? I know the argument for nmap is that it is the leading tool for enumerating a network, but yeah, social engineering toolkit, yeah, port scanning, but that is that is what nmap is. So I'm not really sure if, if the actually a tool called so tool port scanning. Is it really one? Yeah, probably is. Probably is. You know, there are so many tools these days, and sometimes they want to compete. So I think this tool is fine if you want to have some sort of, you know, one click wonder. You can install your, your favorite tool, and then I guess be my guest. Can you actually call it from inside of here? No, we cannot. So I'm forced to go outside and do nmap on this IP that I created. Let's just see. Holy moly. I wasn't the one that I copied 1010 175 to 16. So 1010 175 to 60. Was that correct? Yeah, so we've done the typical in-map scan and it's, you know, yeah. So when you got your tools installed, that is fine. Instead of having a tool like Hacktronian as a typical, what tool do I need to install on my computer in order to do enumeration, you know, just go, go do some research or just install Linux Kali. But it is your choice, of course. So I wanna leave this up to you. Do you like Hacktronian? Leave the comment below and let me know what you think about it. And yeah, happy Easter, by the way. And until next time, I'm just gonna say, take care. Thank you.